Hello, everyone. Welcome back to Basic Podcast. And today, we have finally have Brandon here. Oh, it's about hey, everybody. time. Uh, my bad, my bad. I got duties. Bro. Lagging it over here. All right, I'm sorry. Since the beginning of the podcast, still very few episodes out, and you don't know who we are if you're first listening. I'm Robert. I'm Brandon. I'm Edgar. I'm Josh. And we're Basic Podcast. Yeah. Hello. And today, we have a very special episode. Ooh. Today, we're calling it Mansers. Mansers. <laughs> Because we have our, collectively had some of our female friends ask us questions just about dudes in general. What do they want to know? Interesting. And we'll be answering them to the best of our abilities. Awesome. I'm ready for this. Fuck and just boys. as a, uh, what is it? Just to let you all know out there, this is our views, the four of us as dudes. We don't make up an entire gender. <laughs> These are our answers within here. And then again, we're all friends here. We all share some experiences. Si- similar, similar thoughts. Experiences. Similar, <laughs> similar thoughts. thoughts. Oh, fuck. All right, here we go. Okay, first question. Do guys actually watch porn together? No. Fuck no. We haven't on purpose. <laughs> what? <laughs> we haven't seen it with each other or anyone I, that matter. I think Pretty that's much. weird. It's just a, like the fact that, you know, everybody has a hard on them. You know, and with the bunch oh, of okay. dudes well, in the room, like well, fucking all the sword together. fights over here. <laughs> so you're saying that when a guy's watching, he automatically gets a hard on. Well, I do. You know, I do. It might, <laughs> it might turn. You I don't on. know because because like I feel like there's moments where like guys can be like watching something and like you know I don't, I don't like this. Yeah, but I mean like well, I try it's I, just. Well, oh wait, it's are you talking about like the dialogue part of porn where it's like? Did you order a sausage pizza? <laughs> sure, why not? This People are into that. And then you're just like you're like skip ten minutes into the porn. See, get to the good shit. I like a story. Okay. Like a story. I like a story. I watch porn for the acting. Okay? Exactly. <laughs> I watch it for like the story. The for the horrible actors. I can't believe in them. Anything <laughs> <laughs> I, mean, I can believe this in. This isn't the beach. This is the bathtub. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I think it's but weird. Yeah, definitely that, it's weird. I okay, don't think i watch it with okay, you guys. That's true. We haven't seen porn together, but we've seen the funny-ass porn clips. Okay, yeah. yeah. Oh, I think where there's no different. penetration Yeah, I think there was one time where I think we all saw the bloopers or someone was like showing bloopers about it. I'm like, that's the only time I've ever remember seeing it together. Yeah. Uh, no, he uh, showed it to us. Like, have you guys seen this before? And we're like, no. But other than blueprint. that, I don't think I've ever ever experienced that. Like actually watching porn. Yeah. Too. What having friends? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> Damn. Oh, dude. But no, as of us in this room, we haven't seen porn together. But there are definitely are dudes out there that have seen porn together, and I feel like that's the older generation. You know, before we all had smartphones, and that's it was true. like just right at our fingertips. Mm. There's no. There's only also fans. like group of friends who like. Show their dicks to each other. I oh, wanted to say that too. Yeah, there are true. dudes who just whip it out in front of each other. That's like, true. Again, it's like none of us here. None of us has ever. We done haven't that. done it on purpose. I'm yet. not gonna lie. I have no. seen one in the middle of fucking class. The guy just pulls it out. <laughs> what the fuck? Who? Yeah. Don't, well, I'm not gonna, don't, I'm don't, not gonna don't, say don't, the name, bro. Dox anyone. I'm not gonna say it, but I mean, it was just random, dude. We were just sitting in class, and the guy just whips it out, and I'm just like, bro, why? What year? This was senior year. Senior year? Yeah. Oh, what the it was fuck? just random as hell, dude. I was just, and he's like, hey, hey, hey look. And I'm like, what? I turn around, like, dude, what? Why, dude? We're in the That's, middle of class. Dude, bro. what? I've, I've had somebody pull their dick out <laughs> yeah, in front of me. Yeah, me too. Yeah. Uh, was, yeah. Remember? Yeah. Okay, I'm not going to say any names, but, you know. He came back from the army. Yeah. Or you know Marines. who you are if you listen to this. <laughs> I, I already know you're talking about. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So like, I was, you know, washing my hands, and he was same. like saying, you know, back over there in the military, we we aren't ashamed. And I'm like, I'm ashamed of mine, you know? <laughs> and so we aren't ashamed to whip it out. And the motherfucker and whips like, it out. We're just looking, and then boom, and then I saw nothing but pink. <laughs> and then, like, I was like, ah, ah my eyes. <laughs> but <laughs> okay. our other friend there who was there, he just kind of like, hmm. <laughs> All right, well, speaking of washing, this still has to do with dick, as we were talking about. Oh. Do guys wipe after they pee? Yes. I, well, I mean, I Wait. personally do, bro. I have I do. to. Got a windmill. Yeah, I do. Not. <laughs> <laughs> I I didn't start wiping till like recently, to be honest. Really? Well, yeah. I de- you, well for me, because I just I, I just shake furiously. I definitely <laughs> <wipe>. <laughs> at that point, <laughs> and then I put it away. Yeah. I definitely wipe now because we're in a pandemic. And That's like it. hand sanitizer is hard to come by. Your shit's sterile, so just get in your hand, lather it up. You're good to go. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I never thought about it that way. <laughs> Jesus <laughs> Christ. <laughs> It's in danger, man. I'm <laughs> no fucking around. I just had to say that joke. This isn't sterile, by the way. That's a myth. But no, uh, yeah. It, it does have For a real, though, I do. Though. Like, I do. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But it's, I'm, you have to know, like, if you're out in public, 
public stalls, like dudes' urinals, there's no toilet paper dispenser, so it's kind of hard to be that's like. Yeah. That's, yeah, like, that's why I shake. I think that's those. Yeah, I those. That's when you have to shake have vigorously, to. <laughs> and also in like men's etiquette in like a public bathroom, if you shake more than twice, you're playing with yourself. So like, it's kind of weird to see someone just so there, kind of just much, like, uh, <laughs> you know, kind of weird. It's their fault of their luck, right? So wait, when you like, never mind. Let's not even go into that. Never mind. Just forget it. Just forget it. <laughs> go on, say it. So how how do you shake it? Like, do you go like freehand or no. like? No, use your hand. You just use your I hand. Just, like, like flick it. <laughs> you gotta get your pinky and your thumb. You did not. You, you, you didn't just, hear the you noise. Just, <laughs> you just you just said you, he just said if you you know touch it twice you're playing with yourself. So no, that no shake, shake it, it twice. Oh, twice. shake it twice. But you shake it more than once. Yeah, obviously. So technically, you're playing with yourself. <laughs> technically, that's why that's why it's weird. But you have to shake it more than twice. I don't yeah. know. Some, I'm trying not to get all them drops. I don't know what hands. dude that shakes it twice and be like, shit's good. Yeah, no matter what. <laughs> if, yeah, if you don't shake more than twice, it just. All over your pants, man. You just ruined my day. <laughs> That's true. Like, there's always gonna be that drop that goes in there. Like it's hard to, it's hard not to get that last drop <laughs> out, or hard to get it out. So what we're saying is, dudes, just wipe. <laughs> just wipe. Yeah. Okay. Next question. What does it actually feel like to get kicked in the balls? Fuck it. Fuck it hurts. Okay. Terrible. Have you guys been hit in the balls? Yes. yes. Okay. I have gotten yep. hit, but I've never gotten kicked like a hard force. I haven't been kicked. I've gotten hit, but with the ball. My brother Ron house my ass on my balls. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> so like, yeah. So I was in my parents' room and I forgot what I did. I, I'm pretty sure I was messing with them. And this motherfucker turns, and fucking throws his leg out and he fucking gets me and I was just like on the floor, holding my stomach because that yeah, was goes, so much it, fucking pain. It's a pain, pain <laughs> that travels up <laughs> to your to, to your like gut. lower abdomen. Yeah. yeah. It's the fucking worst thing ever. I've gotten hit in the balls by many balls before. <laughs> <laughs> Specifically, like soccer balls. We used to play soccer. Oh, because I'm used to play a lot. Yeah. That's right. I've always gotten hit in the balls, and then I don't know. It was like it was just a ball magnet to my balls. <laughs> you know what? That's the ball, true. That reminds me of like a funny joke I saw. This dude. Uh, the joke basically goes, uh, "Giving birth does not hurt as much as getting kicked in the balls." And want to know why? It's because I've never seen a dude say, "Let's do that again." <laughs> yes, seriously. But it's a joke. People, calm down. But yeah, that's just something that I thought of. There's also those people who are getting stepped on, though. That's all getting that's... your nuts crushed, oh, dude. Those are men. Okay, I like getting dominated, but not to that extent. I don't want to be in pain. <laughs> Some do, <laughs> but, but that's like, the thing. They if do you're it because they want do. the pain. Like I don't want like. Like that I pain. don't need that much pain though. But that's that's why they do it though, because they like it. I probably start crying. Like I like I like some pain. Honestly, like yeah, you can I, slap I, me, fucking maybe scratch me. Honestly, a little, we talked about this in our me. previous podcast. That one dude who yeah. liked to be cut. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. yeah that was weird. Like cut? Well, he yeah. he liked knife play. Like knife oh. play. Like just so, yeah, this, this. I guess we're assuming that's what it is, but like no, it, that's exactly that's exactly okay. what it was. So that's what he wanted at least. That's yeah. That's very weird. Yeah. Yeah. There's some weird dudes out there. But yeah, it hurts. At least for me, it hurts. Oh, for me, I think for everybody. Yeah, I'm also pretty sure for mo- for all, not all, maybe not all, but most, it's, it's like, a terrible. It's probably ninety percent. Yeah, <laughs> but I'm assuming like for like women too. Like I know they don't have balls, but you know the, the worst part getting kicked in the nuts is like coming after. It's weird. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? I don't know. For the dudes that like it, what kind of stuff are you Imagine? into? That's the dudes that like it. But anyway, oh shit, that's a joke. Okay, next question: How do guys wear skinny jeans, or rather, how do guys wear skinny jeans in general? Do they just move the penis to one side and let it hang, or? Uh, well, I'm how not... tight are you guys' jeans? Josh, I, I don't wear, I don't wear skinny yeah, jeans. Yeah, you, well, <laughs> you don't wear really jeans in general. I never. Really I wear jeans like often. once a year. <laughs> yeah, you're I don't always like wearing pants. shorts. I'm too hot. So. I ain't big enough for it to affect me. So, <laughs> so it doesn't even go in the pant leg. <laughs> <laughs> it goes in the pant leg. <laughs> <laughs> in the middle. <laughs> oh God! Uh, you have to understand, like the dick is kind of malleable, mm-hmm. especially when it's flaccid. It kind of just like goes. Goes with the flow. It goes with the flow, yeah. But it's when it starts getting hard in your skinny jeans. That's when it starts getting uncomfortable. Yep. And keep in mind, guys do get random boners. That's true. Like you're just sitting yeah. there. High school. You could be tired, and it's just like, no, go away. Just yeah, I think high school like, is like the worst yeah. part. Right, right. I don't know why. Hard, like, like straight up, like I'm like there's moments where I'm just sitting in class, and I'm just literally taking notes, and I know where I'm like, dude, what the fuck? Like, what's I'm wrong with like, you? Oh, now I gotta focus on my notes, so go away. Are <laughs> <laughs> you do the method of like you like flex your bicep yeah, to have the blood go somewhere else? <laughs> come on, come on. And the people looking at you are like the other guys know. <laughs> like, why is his face so red? Oh, he's got a boner. <laughs> uh, have you guys ever had to stand up with the boner? Yes. No. Yeah, I've never had. Luckily, to luckily, yeah, luckily, I've knock never... on wood, I never do have to experience that because I would probably run like in fear, embarrassment. 
I don't know. Me fully hard, it'll just look like my normal bulge. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. That's my Pray Chris. I'm always hard. <laughs> exactly. What was it? Uh, what was I going to say? It was just right on my mind. You were you had a boner standing up? Uh, oh, oh, no, no. Now I remember. Yeah. Uh, that's funny because I remember in high school, girls didn't really know how dudes got boners. Like, I remember this one girl. You guys know her, but I'm not going to dox her. Uh, she said she thought, like, dicks for dudes, when they got boners, they kind of just, like, stuck out. Like, straight or, out, rather like, than like rise. Is type of thing with their tongue? With their mouth thing? Yeah, well, like, I guess it kind of depends. Like, there are some... I'm, I consider myself a grower, <laughs> and it kind of goes more out like that than it does like that. Can you show me? <laughs> <laughs> so, what you're saying, you know... It retracts a bit, but no, not, not like... Straight, not, I know what you're talking about, but not it, straight up. No, more like, just, no, like it's inside of you, and it comes out. <laughs> yeah. Like, cartoon-wise, you know how a dude has, like, boner, it's, <laughs> that, like, sticking that, out? That can't happen so if you're wait, wearing jeans. Are you, any type of are you jeans, turtling most of the time, then? Huh? Are you turtling then? What do you mean? <laughs> Do you consider we tracks. <laughs> well, there's a bit of it, yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Josh. But yeah, I thought that was like, no, what? It's like, it doesn't stick out because she's like, I haven't I've never seen a dude have a boner. She's like, that's because it's like against the pant leg. Mm-hmm. Again, it's not like sticking like... out like a cartoon. Maybe if you're wearing sweatpants, maybe. Yeah. Or if you're, and you got to have like boxes because in briefs, they're kind of like. Well, keep briefs now, yeah, yeah, they're made to like just keep it like in a pocket. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Oh God. Like my shit's kind of <laughs> squished. That's the thing. Not even, not even underwear. I think is it Wranglers that does the whole like U shape pants now, where it gives you like extra room for it too. Maybe. I don't know if you ever seen that. No idea. I, I mean, I don't inward. wear them, but uh, like, <laughs> I think that's the point. Honestly, joggers are nice. Yeah, actually, oh, yeah. Yeah. joggers are nice. Joggers. Yeah, I don't have, a, I don't have a pair, nice. but I, I always think about getting one. It seems like they look so comfortable, comfortable. But I don't, I don't, I don't like wearing pants. I get too hot. I love pants. <laughs> Continue. You used yeah. to wear tights. I got, I'm sitting down. My shit's kind of smushed right now, but it's not bad. Anyways, don't tell <laughs> <go> nuts. <laughs> I looked down. I was like, <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I saw you look down. I was like, what? <laughs> like, really? Let me see. Are you staring at my lumps? <laughs> okay, next question. Humps. It is not dick related. Thank God. Maybe. Do you feel pressure to look a certain way for social media <clears throat> or to get more attention from girls if it is even important to you? No, not really. No. For us in this room, no, because I post the most on social media, and I don't post a lot at all. Yeah. yeah. Out of all of us here. I haven't posted in, like, maybe a year. And <laughs> most of the time, I don't even post selfies. I post stuff of, like, yeah. around me, not really oh, myself. I just post yeah, yeah. My, my freaking Instagram is just basically a concert <laughs> video page, man. <laughs> yeah, That's like, Brandon had a baby. I don't even think he's posted his baby. And That's true. <laughs> I should, if you listen to this, it's a lie. <laughs> no, it's not, bro. I can't wait now to show them. <laughs> Um, oh yeah. Pull it up right now in the video. Go. <laughs> yeah, got you. <laughs> Look at his page. All I'm saying is that women lie. She lied to me. <laughs> <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Just kidding. Uh, she said she was on the pill. Oh, <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, You're kidding. But that we talked about this actually like a while ago. Uh, if anything, I get more uh, concerned about posting a picture, uh, like of myself on a dating app. Well, yeah, because then that's what's like I'm just trying to sell myself literally to a woman. I think that's that's only, who I'm attracted to. The only to. time it would matter. Yeah, because on social media it doesn't matter. You just it's like, yeah, I'm most just of posting it's what BS I want, anyways. whatever you want. I'm not trying yeah. to impress anybody really. Exactly. Like personally, for me, it's like the only time I want to look good is when I'm going to hang, go hang out somewhere publicly. Like if it's just to go to a grocery store and make a quick run, I don't mind how I look. I yeah, but be... there are those dudes that post on the social medias with like their snapbacks and like their wad of cash with a gun maybe it's like what's <laughs> up dude like check it out I I'm know you want to smash I know you want to smash there are those dudes know. but oh, we're not that. those dudes I can't do that I'm I'm not confident enough in my ability to do that post a selfie online yeah that's why I don't have any pictures of me on I, mean, I have a few pictures of myself but it's like very and if few. I do post a picture of myself it's because someone else took the photo that's true hmm. oh, yeah. and you're like that's a cool ass photo and then put it up yeah <laughs> well because I played a lot of music and that was oh, to like yeah. promote Honestly, my music the only, oh, yeah, the only yeah, time yeah. I take selfies which is weird is just when I send it to the homies like on Snapchat those yeah. like, just like weird random pics of like those filters and stuff <laughs> I feel like it's the only time I actually take selfies and actually show anyone those selfies it's usually, I'm usually drunk when I do that that's <laughs> true do you have any <laughs> drunk pictures I have of you yeah. <laughs> a lot <laughs> the ra- okay the amount of drunk photos we have of each other <laughs> spooning each other because we're homies it's <laughs> <laughs> <That's> hilarious <laughs> you gotta kiss the homies goodnight that's, that's actually homosexual. that actually leads into the the next question oh really? what's one thing guys low-key or secretly wish they can enjoy without judgment 
that girls do regularly, kissing the homies goodnight. Yeah. Kissing the homies yeah, goodnight. Yeah, that's one of them. wrong with that? Every time. <laughs> do it. It makes them feel I better. Want, I want, uh, <laughs> but the examples pipes. are like nail Pillow salons, pipes. wearing certain colors, sleepovers. Okay, first of all, guys, don't call it sleepovers. Mm. We just, just say, yo, can I crash? Yeah. Crash tonight. Yeah. Or we drink a lot. We're at someone's house. Our friend's house is like, yo, you can crash here if you want. Like, we got couch. We got floor. We got bed. Wherever you the want. Floor. <laughs> the floor. We got floor. We got bed. <laughs> but the bed's got me in it. <laughs> no, I think the, 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 uh, the only one, like, like I told you, I think since we were talking about earlier, uh, the nail salon stuff, like, yeah. I, I don't mind doing a nail salon. Me neither. I'd probably want I to wouldn't go. mind either, but I've said this before, like, I'm very frugal and cheap, so it's not That's an expense true. I have to do. And also, it's time and money. I can't do that. No, That's yeah. the only reason. I, what I, I mind, The only reason I want to go is because I got fucked up nails. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, mine aren't bad. It's just that, I mean... Doing a little quick touch up isn't bad either. Yeah, so. no, yeah, because I, I bite them and then like I let them grow out and then I bite them so they look weird. <laughs> but then, I, but then at the end, it's just kind of like you know, if you don't care what other people think, then you know you can do it. I mean, I don't, I don't want to yeah, give yeah. a shit. But like, like, like Robert said personally, I don't want to be paying that much just to get my nails like. Oh yeah, um, nice, bro. I'm just like, nah. I don't know how so much it costs either. Yeah, you know? it's not a necessity unless it's not a necessity. Someone said, once you get your nails done, you just start. Uh, I'm not. Uh, what's a nice way of saying this that won't offend anyone? <laughs> I, th- I think I know what you're saying. Um, you start drowning in pussy. <laughs> oh, then yeah, I'm gonna do it. Um, <laughs> a lot of like the new, they do like the girl. Oh like, yeah, yeah. The There's nails. a lot of guys that have been doing the whole painting, painting nails thing, or getting like your eyebrows like threaded. That shit fucking hurts. No, you see, no, the only what? dudes that get their eyebrows threaded are fucking cholos. Hey fool, I'm I don't not. cholo. <laughs> You get your I mean, I've I've gone them through it and it fucking hurt. I'll tell you that. I've I heard have this. never done it. Well, you do have to. But I notice most of the dudes that be <laughs> like, guys who are the most homophobic usually do this stuff, which is weird to me. Like they get their eyebrows threaded, mm. they take care of themselves. But yeah. that's actually mm. true. But like you wear pink, it's like, hey fool, get the fuck like, away from I, me. I've seen, like on Instagram, so sometimes I see guys like getting their haircuts and they also do their like uh, their brows eyebrows. and stuff. And I'm just yeah. like, huh, I mean that's that's cool, but this, these are the guys, the ones that are like, oh no, bro, like. Like it's gay to do this. I'm like, nah, bro. I ain't like, gay. same dudes that fuck ass in prison. Sometimes you gotta suck dick. You know? <laughs> uh, but yeah, like, I feel like wearing pink is also something that was like more pink. prevalent when we were younger. Like wearing pink now as a dude is largely way more acceptable. Yeah. Yeah, I remember when you guys make fun of my my salmon colored uh, sweater I used to have. I still make. Fun. You guys make fun of me. I'm like, bro, oh, that pink sweater. Pink. Yeah. Okay, fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> fuck you. You got me there. Salmon. But it's honestly, it's a nice, it's a nice sweater. I like. How it. do you say salmon? Salmon. 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 <laughs> the most pinkest shit I ever seen was those balls, man. Okay. Oh god. god. I know. Don't remind me. Don't my mind. <laughs> Next question. Why men choose to wake up with the audacity? <laughs> That's a funny ass First question. First of because. all, <laughs> the audacity on that person to think that we have audacity when we wake up. Because we rule the world, bit. I mean, <laughs> what? I mean, lovely ladies. We lovely ladies. <laughs> we love the ladies here. I don't know. Just, I guess it's different with everyone. That, that, I feel like that's just a joke question because I feel like I know who asked that. So that's why I'm not seriously answering that. I, don't, I always wake up. Oh, but this one, though. <laughs> feel like the same person uh why do men wake up with the conf oh why do mediocre men wake up with the confidence of a greek god that's not all all men that's not, that's not i all definitely men. don't but have the confidence of a greek it's god. because oh, no. these cheap ass women like yeah. to give this mediocre oh, whoa, whoa, man whoa 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 whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> respect all women here you be careful uh, what you're saying all right <laughs> but it's true but it's, it's his ability to pull, I guess, certain women that gave him uh, the confidence I've, in the first place. i mentioned this to brandon egger it's basically dudes who I've just never heard the word no. Pretty much. Well, like, yeah, like either he's women. targeted like certain girls, like he know will say yes, mm-hmm. or it just but he's just gotten. They're lucky. also the guys that are like when the girl says no, they're like they get pissed they off. They get about the it. angriest. Yeah. yeah, that's the yeah, same I don't dude. Get that dude. At the same time, that's not all men. Again, no, yeah. you say mm. no to me, I'm just gonna cry. I'm <laughs> <laughs> be like, okay, deuce. <laughs> Couldn't say it any better. <laughs> dude. No. Yo, do that again. I'm a bust in the tears. <laughs> Gold. <laughs> uh, funny. Uh, but yeah, no. Some dudes definitely. Some dudes definitely n- wake up with the was it confidence of a Greek god. We know that it's not a it's secret. Not yeah, there are definitely some dudes out there, and we hate them too. Yeah, 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 yeah definitely. <laughs> those are the same dudes posting those Instagram pictures with the snapbacks and the the cash and the guns. Like yo, sad. <laughs> yeah, that's that, that's them. Uh. Why do men feel like it's not serious to cheat, but the minute someone cheats on them, it's the biggest deal ever? Uh, first, 
that's not First all men. All. <laughs> Again, it's, it's not all I've men. I've never cheated in my life. Yeah, I feel like that's that dude who woke up with the confidence of a Greek god. <laughs> it's, probably, go. it's probably that it's probably guy. That <laughs> guy. It's probably that guy. It's probably that guy. Yeah, but it definitely some dudes get butt hurt when they cheat, and it happens to them. But you have to realize those are the dumb guys, and the dumb guys are usually the loudest guys, and the loudest ones are the ones you're listening to. Pretty much. Yeah, that's good. You should, it's probably that quiet guy is the one that's going to appreciate you. Yeah. We can, He's going to love you. <laughs> <laughs> He's got a flannel shirt. It's okay. <laughs> but spirited away. He works at an anime store. <laughs> That's funny. But no, we definitely don't cheat. No, like, if no. I'm talking to someone or if I'm with Cheating someone, regardless, is bad. You know, it's yeah. like, but that's not right. What? What would you consider cheating? Like, that's, people that, that's what I was gonna ask because I think I feel like everyone sees cheating in a different way. Yeah, like there's some people who like if they're flirting with you and you're not saying anything back, like as in, you know, stopping them from flirting with you, they consider that cheating. Well, the thing is, I have home girls, like friends that are girls, who are my friends. Like, if I'm talking to someone who I want to be with, I can still talk to that person because that's my friend, and I'm pretty sure she's going to meet them. Eventually. Yeah. No, yeah, but... Yeah, but... The, so that uh, won't be cheating. But that's like, not considered cheating. Like, okay, like, let's say like, you're with... Like, some girl's flirting. Let's say you got a girl. Mm-hmm. Some girl's flirting with you, but you're not mm-hmm. telling her this anything. This is fantasy. Fantasy? Okay, go on. <laughs> <laughs> so, but you're not telling her, like, hey, I have a girlfriend, you know, stop. No, you're just letting it happen. You're, just, you're continuing it, and <laughs> then... Is that, would that be considered Is that micro-cheating? I feel like that's a word. <laughs> a micro-cheating. Is it? Like, that, I, don't, I feel like I'm that's a at. word, though. Like, people have said that. But I feel, I feel like that like is... Like, it's not cheating, but it is... It's sus to me. It, that's yeah, sus. Yeah, definitely sus. No, yeah, I, I, I'd consider... I wouldn't be, like, breaking up, but I'd be like, you know, it's kind of... Uh, it doesn't, like it doesn't, it doesn't, yeah. doesn't want you want to continue with that. Be a little yeah. disappointed, but like, yeah. why don't you just you not know, mad. tell them? I'm disappointed. <laughs> yeah, but no, <laughs> but I, like, I don't do that. Yeah, I anything do like what? I guess anything you falls into like first base to like second base, that'd be mm-hmm. probably cheating, right? Because you're I, letting somebody who's not your significant other like. Okay, what's something. first base to you though? Isn't that like touching? Dude, mine is so different. We've had this conversation. Yeah, long we've had this long ago. Yeah. We had it. Mine was so, so innocent. Ba- <laughs> every, Brandon's was like holding hands as first base. <laughs> Fuck you. What? That's not, what? what? I'm sorry. I was born right. Yeah. <laughs> you weren't raised right. I was going to get a bunch of girls and they're like, oh, it's like, fuck you. That's not, no. <laughs> no. But I, I, that's what I thought it was. You know, I didn't know the bases. First of all, I thought I was holding hands, kiss on the cheek. And then, like, kiss oh on the God. lips, and then sex. And then you put a baby in her. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's oh, a home base. <laughs> <laughs> home bases don't pull out. It's a home run. Um, well, isn't first base kissing, second base is, like, touching, and then third base is, like, is it oral, or is that, like, full-on sex? I feel like it's oral. Like, that's what I've always described oral. it as. Third yeah, base I always oral, thought third, right? base was, uh, third base was for sure oral. I'll remember. Yeah, and then, like, you know, uh, first home base run. is staring at her in the eyes. Second basis. <laughs> no, I remember <laughs> talking made, about your dreams. I remember <laughs> Robert made fun of me because he's like, "How the fuck do you go from kissing on the lips to sex? Like it's just yeah. a big jump. Yeah, it's a big jump. <laughs> no. See, that's why his met. It's flawed. Yeah. No, I understand why it's flawed. But you know, I'm sorry. I'm so innocent. All right, next question. Oh, answering the other one. Uh, dudes, some dudes definitely get butt hurt, but those are the most immature ones. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I think so. That. You're going to meet bad dudes. You're going to meet good dudes. You just got to know where to pick them. You're going to meet some that cheat. You're going to meet some that not. It's honestly... It, you it's could never just, tell, though. You're just going to have to, like, weave through all the bad guys to weave, find... Weave. <laughs> <laughs> until you get the next one. The good one. Okay, next question. Do you talk to your friends about the girls you talk to? To an extent. Yeah, yeah to, an extent. to an extent. Like, I, I would say I'm talking to this person, but I wouldn't... Depends how far you're into it, you know? It was like, dude, I've been talking to this girl for like three months, you know. Yeah, I think so. I, and then, like, you're really like, into I'll, the girl. I'll, I'll tell him like, oh yeah, I'm talking to this girl, but I feel like that's the most I ever say. Like, I wouldn't tell him exactly what we talk about or what we do. No, yeah, yeah, we don't go into specifics. Yeah, that's no, what we yeah. don't. So, like with us here, like we'll know when we're talking to someone because like, we'll, we'll, we'll decide to hang out with her more. Yeah. Yeah. Pretty much. Yeah. yeah. Like, but we'll we can't probably do that spit now. out a pandemic. few details, but it's not going to go into like every, the whole category yo did you guys know she had like serious trauma when she no it's not gonna be like that that. and i I just be like oh she's cool she likes this and just like it's like yo who you texting oh i'm texting ladies blah 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 blah. take note of this it's cool this guy might not agree with me what but don't send nudes to just anybody 
All right. Some friends have. Wait, 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 wait. Why would you say we would? I feel like we should include that though. Like, yeah, because that wasn't. Well, th- that's true though. Like, yeah, you shouldn't send them to that. anyone. Cause yeah, dude, fr- I had. Uh, I don't, but there are friends who would show their friends. There's yeah the in high school, dude. Girls. In high school, there was there was guys you, that would show me know. other girls. Oh, so that, don't show your friends the nudes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. you okay. never do that. That's, That's like the, the one. I didn't never do that. Oh yeah. Also, if you break up with the girl, delete her nudes. Oh yeah, definitely. Yeah, don't. Why, why would you keep them? Yeah, you shouldn't. Keep Some them. dudes keep them. Uh, no, I can't do that, bro. Yeah, That's us. Also, I don't. I definitely don't show my friends, my girls that have sent me some stuff of them because that shit's mine. I work for that. <laughs> what have you done to deserve it? Dude, like, that's how I fucking see it. I think that's it. the yeah, most that's fucked true. up shit you can do. It's just like show everybody. It's like, you Definitely. know, that girl gave you, sent these to trusted you. you. She you trusted, trusted you. you. Exactly. Damn. But yeah, that was a question I didn't see in here and I thought I had to freak up. No. <laughs> Because that kind of goes with it. Definitely. All right. How differently do you act in front of your friends versus your girlfriend? Oh, I definitely fuck. don't go all out. I don't go all out. Especially if she's if I'm just bringing her to the group. But if she's been with us for a while, then then she'll. It's definitely my personality yeah. that she's yep. seeing. No, I I usually act the same. Um, like a dumbass. Unless you get nervous. <laughs> <laughs> um, <partly. laughs> no. Um, I I I kind of act the same. It's you, like you, I try to sh- honestly like I try to be you know. I say this, God gave you, uh, you know, one of three things, a big penis, you're good looking, or you're funny. And, and you're God, funny. And God gave me funny, all right? <laughs> <laughs> so I got I, I to gotta show it, all right? Damn, and, what like, if, wait, wait, what if you don't have either of those? You're not God's favorite. Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, I think you just have to, you know, if you know what you're good at or what you have, you know, just kind of, you know, go along with it. And uh, yeah, like, she likes it for a reason. But yeah, you know? like with you and like, well, it was it's kind of different because when we brought you, we already knew your girl bef- like back in like high school. Yeah, I knew oh, I was yeah. friends so with like your girl before I was friends with you. You bastard! How dare you not meet me <laughs> sooner? <laughs> so yeah, with you, like when you first brought her to hang out with us, like we already knew who she was. Yeah, she didn't hang true. out with us. Well, maybe not hang out with us, but talk to us before. Mm-hmm. So we like you know you didn't have to like change the no, way. No, yeah, you exactly. And like she knows how I am. She's known me since high school, so it's it, it's even like easier. I don't have to be nervous about anything. You didn't and really have to, like, change. Exactly. And she knows how I am. I know how she is. Your mannerisms and all that. Yeah. So mm-hmm. nothing's really a surprise. Yeah. You're not shy. You're not treating her like a dick. No, exactly. I guess, I guess in, it would only be in the beginning of the relationship where there would be that bit of a difference, the way you act with your friends and your girl. But yeah. once you get in that comfortable area, um, I'm pretty sure it's not going to be much of a difference you, at all. You know, she almost killed us. <laughs> so the first time we went out, Mm-hmm. It wasn't really like going out. I, I invited her to go get coffee, so we we're going. Right? right. You actually she, went to go get coffee. Yeah, I love I coffee. I love coffee. <laughs> I went to Tiramia. It's not really coffee, but whatever. It's coffee. <laughs> it's caffeine in there. And um, I was driving on the freeway, and like I was singing. I I, I can't sing, but I love to sing. And then she was kind of nervous, you know. I'm like, dude, like relax, you know. You know me. I know you. You know, you don't have to be nervous. And I'm driving, singing, and she fucking whips her hair, like fucking <laughs> like a windmill. And it scares the, the fuck car? out of me in the in the car, and I swerve a little bit. I was like, "Oh, what the fuck are you doing?" This bitch being possessed. <laughs> in the other lane, and I scared the fuck out of me. And she's like, "Oh, I'm sorry. You told me to be myself." I'm like, "Okay, yeah, you're, you know, it's okay, good, be but less it's okay, be less of yourself. <laughs> <laughs> Just enough so we don't die." And then, like, uh, we went to go eat. I took her to breakfast, and I was fucking. These guys know how I eat. I'm fucking. I eat a lot. So I'm there eating, and she's right there, like boy. cutting slowly, you know, cleaning herself. She's I'm like, like what oh, the fuck are you doing? Eating proper. I'm gonna eat that. <laughs> <laughs> Take her pancakes, and then now she just fucking eats like, like how I would. Uh, basically, what this is going down to, again, every guy is different. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. There's no 100 percent answer between any of us. Oh yeah, no. definitely. If it, but my answer would be, I would definitely not go full out. <laughs> How yeah. I am with you guys? Yeah, I know. Oh. Even right now, in this podcast version, it's kind of lukewarm. I'm not it's gonna like, go full bro, out. Like, right, same here. We 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 get pretty dumb. It's, look, it's lukewarm, <laughs> but you definitely get I, an idea of who I am. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> like, especially throughout the rest of these episodes, you're gonna see how. And hell, we might even get a little too comfortable. And get out. <laughs> we have Sorry. a pool going on. Who's gonna get canceled first? <laughs> 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 All right. Next question. All right. Oh, perfect. Can you read this one? Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's the, the one that I don't understand. The one that you don't understand? <laughs> yeah. Okay. So, okay. No, so, it's what's kind of confusing? I'd say, so, I'd um, that. when you are dating, what are you expecting versus a girl that you truly want to be with? So, I'm guessing it's what they were asking is like, uh, when you're dating someone, what do you expect from it, I guess? Like, what are you expecting from the girl? 
versus a girl that you truly want to be with. It's a well, so that that question is honestly though when I was reading it I'm like I kind of understand it I kind of don't but then I do. To reword it. it it's this just, is exactly how it's written. Exactly, exactly how they asked it. Okay, read it exactly how it's written again. So when you are dating, what are you expecting versus a girl that you truly want to be with? That, that that's why I'm like so I, I think what like, she means is like if you're like dating multiple people, but let's say you're not da- you're not you're like with how the, is it dating a girl versus the girl what, you, you, want, really want, you want you want. Um, I don't. I, don't I, don't, know, I haven't been on a date since like high school. <laughs> <laughs> well, <laughs> my answer to that was, if I'm dating a girl, it's because I want to be with her. Yeah, that's it. See, you know, yeah, you date someone because you like what they, the qualities they have, who they are as a person, and you don't get with someone just to be with them for a, you know for a little while. And well, then some un- people. Then under that, well, yeah, but under that it says, do you give so so energy? I feel like that's connected to that. So so. Well, I guess yeah, it depends like, on. It so would what? depend on the date, right? Like if you're with her, like just talk with her, like, rather than not being with. I her I guess if you're not vibing, I guess you would be like. So if like y'all yeah. really like connecting and shit, do you then just, you would like, give more energy. Do you like give Shorty a chance still, or like? Yeah, if you're if you're <laughs> if the vibes are right, then you just keep giving that same energy, and mm-hmm. then it just works out. But if if you're not guys aren't vibing, then I'd probably give like less energy. Like okay, it's not really working out. Like, I'm not digging this girl. It doesn't seem like she's digging me. Mm-hmm. You know, then you kind of, that's when the energy starts depleting. <laughs> well, would you want them to tell you or just kind of like let it die on its own? Honestly, it was like, you won't know until it's already dying, you know? Oh, okay. I, like, I don't know. It'll probably be like towards the end of that. I'm like, ah, I don't really see this going anywhere. Like, this yeah. is it, you know? Because I think the, oh, bad thing, you're just kind of stringing them along. That's why, you know. It's like, I think it's just better for them to say it than, like, you know, like, keep it going and, like, let it die. Because you just, like, if you're not feeling it, that's fine. You know, no, you're not obligated to. And, like, obviously, it. if you're on the date, you can keep trying. Maybe there's a certain thing that you guys connect with. But at the end of the day, I'd say if it wasn't there, then it's not there. Uh, I'd rather know in the beginning so I don't have to put my time and effort into well, all my jokes. Well, you don't know from the very beginning. No, well, I know, but... You know, as as it goes, this you is. You want to like, know as early as possible. as early as possible, like you know, if she doesn't like me, that's fine. I, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna be mad and you know throw a fit. Yeah, it's a very long answer for a question I don't uh, understand. So I, yeah. I honestly, I can't give a full answer. Me neither. It's, it's, it's it. kind of difficult to understand. So sorry about that question. So we're gonna move on to the next one. Uh, when would you say is a good time to meet your family? When would you say, Brandon? <laughs> <laughs> when you get oh, it <laughs> sorry like my pullout game's weak and shit son so, so like, here's my mom it was <laughs> wrong until I was lied to alright just kidding it wasn't lied mm-hmm. um, I was, don't know honestly uh, it depends it's just like I, I think you should at least have a good amount of months before you meet the family yeah. the family should at least know about the other person yeah should at least know like they're dating they're, you know, like you leave dating. to another country come back oh this is my wife <laughs> <laughs> like what That's um, I don't know like but with, 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 with you, 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 you said you met your uh, your girlfriend's uh, family before you got you got her pregnant. Oh right? yeah, yeah, okay. yeah. I met them like, oh, oh, fuck. How long were you guys together? When I met them, mm-hmm. like three months in, I think. Okay, okay. three months how, is brand like, new. How <laughs> comfortable were you guys in your relationship? Oh, it, well, again, it goes back to like you know because I've known her for so long, we're really comfortable already. Mm-hmm. So okay. yeah, so it, it, there wasn't that like period where it was like. You guys had to get used to each other, and then, like, you guys finally, like, are together, and it's like, oh, you guys actually, you know, like each other, mm-hmm. and then yeah, as, I, I feel like it's kind of advanced a bit As long more. as there's mm-hmm. some form of trust between you guys, I feel like that's when you know, like, okay, I guess it's... Like, when you know you have these okay. feelings for that person, I'd say it's okay. Yeah, yeah, it's not really, like, uh, exact But, like, time. maybe you get mm-hmm. know that mm-hmm. the feelings are mutual, like, you, like, you really like her, and she really likes you, mm-hmm. you know? And, um, so it's, like... Uh, you guys are on the same level. So yeah, you're not yeah, just yeah. like bringing like, oh, here's my family and she's not ready to no, meet yeah. your family, you know? So again, it's it kind of varies. It's different. <laughs> it varies. It varies. It varies. These are very hard, specific, to, hard to get it's specific. It's when you feel like it's answers. right. <laughs> Honestly. <laughs> or you get them pregnant first. Yeah. <laughs> well, you can kind of have to. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> my bad dog. Got a bun in the What's oven. What's up, dad? <laughs> <laughs> hey, dad. <laughs> so you can go up. Yeah, that one's a complicated one as well, in a way. It's a, in its own way. Yeah. All right, next one. Yeah, what can you do to show you like someone? We'll do, we'll do two versions, guy to girl, girl to guy. 
Well, for guys, it's like I think it's kind of. Well, no, because there's a lot of fuck boys. Well, know? it depends. Everybody has. But their it's kind of easy to spot a fuck boy. Well, to us, to us. Yeah, yeah, to us, it's like everybody's got their own like vision of like, affection. Mm-hmm. Some people like words of admiration. Some people like touch. Yeah. Some Giving people gifts, touch gifts. You know, you know. I so think, it's a, it depends on the person. I think it's kind of like the energy they're giving back. If like, we're talking about like wanting to talk to someone stage, uh, like let's say you're texting each other, definitely replying to the text messages. Yeah. Definitely. Shows, mm-hmm. shows you like them or even initiating the conversation. Initiating. Like the, hey, good morning or hi. But it, it sucks when you're the only one initiating. <laughs> <laughs> you're the only one sending the messages. <laughs> yeah. No, um, yeah, it, like I think if you just, uh, like communication is like, you know, you shouldn't be mad if they lag it because, you know, what if they're busy or something like that? Yeah, people it's, are busy. Yeah, people get kind of crazy like that. Okay, well, I'll ans- ask this one as well since it seems to tie into that. How would you make it clear to someone that you're absolutely not interested? So we'll do how to make it clear you like someone, how to make it clear you're not into them. I would just say it. I'd yeah, rather not like, I like from you. Some dudes are very straightforward. Yeah. From my yeah. experience, I just told her, I, I, I'm i sorry, I'm not really interested like that. No, yeah, I think it's better just so they know, you know, not to have any hope. I mean, I'm sorry. Not like, to you know, string him along. Yeah. Sorry, sorry. I, I, like, I like... know I'm a good dude and shit. Just like, <laughs> we, we're not vibing. We're not vibing. There's no vibes here. And uh, I, that's all I, what I would do. Just I would try it. to be as straightforward as possible. Well, yeah, uh, how about a girl rock. to a guy? Because some again, we went over like some dudes get pretty butt hurt. Girl to guy, yeah. yeah. Like I know it would to hurt let a guy me. know they're not interested. Like it's happened before. <laughs> it's like oh, it's like sorry, you know. I would at least want an answer of like just friends or something. Yeah, that's how exactly. Because I, I can fucking yeah. deal with it. That's the thing. It's yeah. like you know, give me a day, give me a day, <laughs> <laughs> give, give me a day, give me a day in a bottle of vodka. I'm like, I'm fine. <laughs> no, yeah. As long as I think just being straightforward is just the best thing you can best do. Best way yeah. uh, uh, for some dudes. Yeah. Yeah, for, keep okay, in mind, yeah, for, some do. Uh, I'm I am small. I'm not that intimidating. <laughs> so, but then there are dudes who are huge and are intimidating. So that's mm. what girls are. Some girls fear. Yeah. Yeah. But oh, yeah. Telling, some like, dudes, telling that big. Because some dudes who look like men aren't men and can't just can't take that shit. Yeah, it's it's fucking stupid. Can't take the rejection there. Yeah. yeah. So that probably again ghosting seems to be another answer that comes to mind if you're not I don't into like someone. Ghosting. Me neither. But like, sometimes you have to do it. Cool. it. But if you've known her for like a couple of weeks, I mean, yeah, if she I'm can ghost you. Mad, Honestly, yeah. it says. I guess yeah. Saying nothing also says a lot. Yeah, that's, that's true. true. It's like oh, she's not responding, so I guess she's gonna cry. Yeah. 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 Okay. Yeah, that makes sense. I feel for a girl that'd be a little more easier to do. Yeah, saying nothing it's, says a lot. Yeah. Or you could straight up tell them if you've known them for a very minimum amount of time you can definitely ghost them yeah it's, it, it's chill but yeah, like you said then again not every guy's the same so not every yeah. guy would take it as a yeah he, she does at least in that it. scenario if you know them for a little bit and you know you'll never see them again you can ghost them yeah definitely. but you maybe you might run into them who knows maybe this guy's yeah, crazy definitely <laughs> maybe he already has your address i don't know <laughs> Shit. definitely like if you go to the same school or you like see them at work or something like, yeah, yeah yeah that's that's when it's like yeah, you, you don't shit where you eat yeah <laughs> <laughs> one all right for the next question uh what is something men can do to make women feel safe around them example like a woman walking alone at night you're walking behind her what is something you can do to ensure she is safe and not terrified because she is that's a that's how i mean toughie. honestly if i was in that situation i just slow down yeah that's like let the woman keep getting further ahead like of me that's, that's or even i'll stop and check my phone for like a minute and then yeah but the phone seems kind of weird oh like, that's who, true who are you talking yeah, to? yeah like, well, it's, true. it's like what are you planning to do huh the who else is around yeah. but yeah de- my definitely go to because that is weird it's just like walk it, even and just so, a little bit slower but mind my own fucking business yeah, yeah just like okay because it just happens sometimes that you just end up walking behind this girl i feel like the one thing you shouldn't do is straight is like start straight because that's it's, she's probably gonna think like you're staring at her the whole time too. Straight or just at the floor because like, that's where I stare at anyways. <laughs> I will stare at the floor. I think staring straight, and then she's right there. That'd be kind of weird. Or even across the street, maybe if you can't have or to. Like, if you can, you can walk faster. Like or, or she, walk past her, yeah. <laughs> like if she's just double taking back, then it's like, oh, she's definitely just <laughs> okay. Someone's yeah. behind me. Start running at her. And th- no. <laughs> <laughs> Try making sure she's safe. <laughs> get home safe. Yeah, no, she's just tell her to get home safe. <laughs> Yeah, that's our answer for that question in that oh, certain scenario. Like, yeah. What is it? When guys say they prefer a girl with no makeup, do they actually mean no makeup or do they mean natural looking makeup? 
This is a question that I feel like any answer has <laughs> doesn't satisfy anyone. Uh, yes, pretty much. I think it's like a little bit of both. It's like sometimes, you know, these girls, when they don't have any makeup up, makeup on, it's like they still just look just as beautiful as they were when they did, you know? Simp. What a simp. <laughs> what the fuck okay. is that? Okay, and then. Uh, um, okay, just say your answers to makeup, no makeup, natural looking makeup, go. Natural Brandon. looking makeup. Talking to your mic. Natural looking makeup. <laughs> natural looking makeup. Just a little bit of makeup, to be honest. I like any type because. That's, a, I, I mean, that's why. That's why I like all of them. Oh yeah, you're the you're the so, artist here, so yeah. you like all oh, of them. Oh, by the way, ladies, since I do art, I can notice when you run out of certain color <laughs> and you put another one. It just it bugs me a bit because it's like, oh, you ran out of something, didn't you? But I'm not gonna point it out. <laughs> it's just like I'm very into colors and like I can see the difference. You're just so like, like I, I can mm, see. She it. didn't blend it well. <laughs> I'm not gonna say anything. Ran out of a certain. But kind of at the foundation. same time, it, like if I am with a girl, which I've dated a girl and I've saw her without makeup, she usually hide her face. It's like. I don't fucking care. I see, yeah, if, if, you're like, dating, yeah your if you're with or dating with the person, like, like I, don't I understand care she doesn't want to show it, but it's like, if you're doing that, it's like, oh, guys really think we're, we wear makeup for that. But it's like, uh, you're covering your face when you don't have makeup, so you're making it seem like you're wearing it for me. Yeah. In that situation, it's like, just don't. That's when I say I don't care about makeup if it's in that situation. Yeah. Like, it's, she's already your girl, yeah. you know, it's like, it doesn't, mm-hmm. honestly, oh, that yeah. doesn't matter. Because I think when you first meet the person, you want to impress, right? So you're not going to go just however oh, you yeah, want either. In the beginning, yeah, yeah I can see. That's understandable. Like, yeah, it's understandable. But I mean, once you've been with the person or dating person for a while, I mean, personally, There's gotta I, be I don't care. some sort of comfort zone, right? I yeah. do appreciate a good amount of makeup. Like, they, if you they know how to do well. it well. Yeah. Like, like let's say, like, on a special date night. Kind of like, hot, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, it can be, yeah. Like, on a special date saying. night, and then she has, like, she puts on, like, ni- like, a, like, nas- like, like nice makeup, mm-hmm. then, yeah, that's understandable. And, so yeah, you like shadow go on. Red lipstick. You like I don't the red know. Lipstick? Do what you want. <laughs> Again, it really doesn't matter to me. I like it a lot. None. I like... All. I like girl. <laughs> I like woman. <laughs> girl look good. Woman. Woman, 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 woman. I like... You seen that that video? I don't like mans no more. I don't like mans no more. <laughs> <laughs> I love women. <laughs> that guy's a comedian, right? Huh? That guy's a comedian. Where was that from? It, no, I it saw was, it on like TikTok somewhere. It was um, they were it was like they were having a like a ceremony, like a pastor. It was like a church event. Oh, and they brought him out. Sense. I thought it was like, a comedian. I don't or something, like bro. mans no more. Because I, I just like it's something I wouldn't like picture just anyone just doing in the middle of a church, but bro. He was like, <laughs> I like women. I like women, 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 women. Okay, to go with that question. How much is too much makeup for you guys, at least? Uh. When you can see the a literal skin. clown makeup, like <laughs> if I'm like <laughs> if I literal and clown. there's like a literally a face like print on Gigolo. my shirt. There you go, bro. Gigolo makeup. Gigolo. Damn. Oh, Juggalo. Juggalo. Fuck, Juggalo. It's, it's Juggalo. Juggalo. Sounds like Juggalo. <laughs> insane clown posse. Yeah, right? insane clown posse makeup. Jesus ICP. Christ. There's um, like, I, I mean, <sighs> there's a story, but uh, go on. Oh, mm-hmm. uh, uh, talking to your mic. Me and the uh, the homie Meg were. Um, Miguel, not not the not girl. Miguel, Miguel, and um, we're dropping off another friend who was a girl, mm-hmm. home. And if I can, Meg, you fucking hit the brakes really hard, and she fucking <laughs> oh, I hit the fucking now. seat, and her <laughs> face is there. <laughs> oh my god, that was a lot of makeup. But I mean, like you know, it's whatever they like. They usually just put it on for them, and I believe them. Yeah, uh, but you know. Is that too much makeup? Like, if it comes off on the Z? Yeah, I believe like that's touch. too much makeup. I, th- I think that just has to do with the makeup itself. I yeah. think so. It's oh, probably, it? like, oh, so much like that, the like, amount. Like, low quality makeup, maybe. I don't know. Damn, you got I know nothing makeup? about makeup, but I want to learn. Yeah. I do want to learn how to do, like, good makeup. Maybe because mm-hmm. I'm an artist. I just want... That is an art to me. Mm-hmm. Just, maybe it <laughs> seems like... The you got to start off with a great canvas. That's got to be your canvas. I think it seems like they're wearing a lot of makeup because girls don't know how to blend in their foundation well. So it looks like they have like Ooh, cake Josh face. calling out women. Like, <laughs> it looks like they would have cake face because you can see the layer. No, you can see their skin, a different color, and then the and rest the of makeup, their makeup. Yeah. So <laughs> so yeah. One thing I know about makeup is like there's different brushes and every brush has its own purpose. Exactly. That's crazy like the big me. puffy one is like for, I think it was for <laughs> the blush. The big puffy one? Uh-huh. Yeah. This dude lingo That's the only one I remember, right? <laughs> I don't know what it's called. I just said big puffy one. one. Can that's I get the big puffy plush or brush? Please? <laughs> that's, that's, I, that's, so that's crazy to me. Like this is a different size. I didn't know that. Mm-hmm. Yes. <laughs> yeah, I, mean, I meant the different no, size, but each one has like, their own purpose. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Their own purpose. 
I just thought they were like, they do the same thing, just, you know, a different amount. <laughs> I, think, I think it just depends on how well they wear it, like how well they do it. Um, if it looks well, then it's, then it's good makeup. But the thing is, there are dudes out there that only like women with makeup. Like, it's weird to me. It's like go put on some makeup or whatever. I I don't fucking know. Those guys are weird. They're just probably like uh like uh, embarrassed. I I would assume aren't they like embarrassed to be seen with her? Is that what you mean? Because Very insecure dudes. Hmm. Probably like they only want to be seen with like the best looking girl. Yeah. So I don't, mm-hmm. I don't know. Maybe avoid those mm-hmm. guys. <laughs> yeah see i'm in the mindset of do what you want yeah yeah mm-hmm. pretty much like i'm with you for that comfortable like if i'm with the girl like i'm with you for that reason mm-hmm. but like if it's a home girl i definitely don't give a fuck no <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah definitely yeah. they do whatever i don't care mm-hmm. like i don't tell you guys like yo dog i noticed you haven't shaved in a while <laughs> <laughs> i'm not talking about your beard either you got, you got, you got to that shit uh, Which these are two day sponsored dollars. I'm fucking <laughs> <laughs> we have a sponsor no, <laughs> my good. other friends always tell me to shave Richard, Richard tells me. I see. I don't tell you to shave everything, but at least clean it up. I do try, but like I let my like my goatee grow out. Because like when (laughs) when you left it out long, and I'm like, bro, at least trim it down. Well, that's the whole point of it is to let it grow out. It was a goatee, and then literally like everybody told me to shave it. Nobody liked it. I I I didn't tell you to shave. shave I just told you to trim it. You You can catch food. Cut that shit out. (laughs) (laughs) Pretty much. Uh, What is it? All right. Well, again, it's every dude's different. For the four of us in here, with me, I don't care. Uh, uh, it doesn't bug me. Doesn't yeah, it doesn't really bug me. Nope. But the three of you do prefer natural makeup, M- natural looking. Looking when I they guess. do wear and stuff like all, if they do like an everyday thing and like it natural depends makeup, on like it's fine. I honestly don't care. But if it's like my like if it's my girl or something like I really don't, wouldn't mind. Like if she has just doesn't wear any makeup at all, it's like it's fine. As long as I find her attractive, then it's fine. Who gives a shit what everybody else? End says. result, we don't know anything about makeup. <laughs> don't know, know nothing I, about. I, women. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> Do what you know. want. You're a queen. Except for you, Angie. Uh, okay. Next <laughs> <one>. <laughs> uh, what do you like that we do? <laughs> I'll say that. <laughs> oh, <laughs> shit, what? <laughs> uh, um, <laughs> okay, ignoring the... <laughs> the next, that, that ties into the next question. Yeah, what do you like that we do? Or what are three things that girls do that are attractive? Dude, when they can uh, take a fucking joke. Uh, <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. When they can take, they can yeah, take a honestly, joke. Yeah, yeah that's I think one of the things they wrote is like... An example is like when she ties her hair up or something. Yeah, when she ties her hair Wait, up. Wait, is this a sexual question? No. I, oh, I, thank God. Just <laughs> random no. things. That, like, I yeah. mean, if you want to make your sexual. No, no. <laughs> I guess, like, if, like, they put the hair in, like, in a messy ponytail, sometimes that looks really cute. Oh, like, messy, yeah. Messy bun. Yeah, messy bun. Yep, like, definitely. Honestly, like, I like it when they take it out for some and reason. Just, like, it's just, like, kind of shake it off. Start shaking it around. Yeah. Yeah. yeah it's nice. Or even just a nice laugh. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Or even if they have, like, a really goofy laugh. <laughs> and it's just, it's just, and sometimes. they think it's bad, but it's like kind of endearing. <laughs> yeah, it's like uh, it's yeah, just so nice. like cute or yep. something, like adorable. Yeah, nice. What is it, the Harry Potter one? <laughs> you, there she was just walking. You know, I like it when they walk. <laughs> 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 That's uh. funny. But yeah, no, um, just three things. It's not something that comes to mind. It's just like, it's, especially since this isn't asking about like physical attributes. <laughs> Someone's calling you right now. Yeah, it's yeah, okay. fine. Uh, like it's just like in mannerisms, I guess this is asking. Cause oh, that, that too. It's just like, you know, if they're acting like, um, stuck up, it's kind of. There's three things you'd like. So you like that? No, no, no. You let me finish. <laughs> so they they have to learn how to, you know, like you said, man, having manners. Okay, manners. Definitely. I don't know. What Taking that. that from school, respect. Knowing their place, got it. Oh God, <laughs> <laughs> Jesus! <laughs> uh, that came a lot later than I thought. Okay. <laughs> okay, this one. What are some three things that the average girl does that annoys you? Okay, first of all, you say average talk. Like it seems <laughs> just kidding. Talk. Like you say average girl. It's like just okay. I'm just gonna get rid of the word average because that sounds weird to me. Uh, three things that the that a girl does that annoys you mm-hmm. exist. Uh, no, I'm oh, no, Jesus. No. <laughs> that uh, annoys me. I don't know. Uh, we talked about this last time. Entitlement, like they're it's entitled. Like yeah, kind of spoiled almost. Yeah, oh, yeah. That's yeah. A big if thing. if they're really spoiled and they're just like, I do whatever the like, like stuck up. I wear nothing yeah. but Gucci yeah. bags. It everything has to be oh, top. Like tier. really snobby. Yeah. Kind snobby. Of, I, I don't know. Like rude to the waiter rude, behavior. Yeah. Like, how dare they do that? Like, like, 
like down to earth girls, you know, like really humble. I'm like, I don't know. I don't like too much. Uh, I'm not too picky. Like, <laughs> I'm not too picky. She, she's woman. I'm, I'm fine with that. <laughs> it's like, I like sass, but to an extent, not yeah. too much sass. Oh, yeah. Like, I not it's, love yeah. sass. That <laughs> is yeah. my shit. Okay. <laughs> so, like, you know, like, example, I'm pretty sure you guys have seen it on, like, on Instagram or just social media in general. Are it's like the. Who, are we talking about who I think we're talking about? Go on. I don't know, but. <laughs> go on. What I was going to say is, like, that's like when um we go live to the restaurant with your girl and they get your order wrong, the guy's order wrong. Oh, the I guy just... doesn't say anything, but the girl's like, hey, hey, I don't know, this isn't right. So they talk to the waiter and stuff. Oh. Oh. I like yeah, that. Man. Like, you that kind of girl who, who, can, <laughs> who can stand up for herself. Okay, not, yeah, not yes. bad. <laughs> like, because I really don't care. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, oh, I didn't like, want uh, cheese. Okay, yeah. but I'll take the cheese anyway. It's okay. Type yeah, of thing, yeah. Get your ass in here, waiter. Yeah, like that type of sass where she's no like, no, uh, uh, no, he said no cheese. <laughs> like that's something like, oh, I, I like that. That's like, that's like cool. That? Learn like, something cool. every day. I don't care about that. <laughs> if anything, that might annoy me. It's like, yo, I did. If I don't have a problem with it, you don't have to either. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> don't make my problems your problems. <laughs> but yeah, just sass to an extent. Yeah, yeah I like. The if sass. it's too much sass, I'm just like. Uh, There's a thing between sassy and then just straight being like. Bitch. I, was yeah, like I didn't want to say it. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, we don't, don't want to say it like that. that. <laughs> All right. Uh, do you like it when girls make the first move? Or is that yes. a turn off? It is a turn on. It is, what right? is this weird thing? If you, like, <laughs> if you like a dude, show it. I like women. <laughs> <laughs> just let them. I don't know. Just I want like, women yeah. like me. You know how I need women like me. <laughs> I think for us, like, yeah, if they do the first move, it's like total, like, yes. Oh, yeah. I don't, but is that, is that <laughs> six big cojones? Right? I'd be so, like, shocked too, but, like, you, you, oh, you like me. But then, again, <laughs> it, but, like, but then again, it'd have to be, like, kind of obvious because with me, it's just, if they're talking to me, it's not automatically, I'm thinking they're into me. So it has to So be, they have to straight up tell you, yo, I like you. Or not, like, yo, but. In a certain like way, you. like, you want to hang how, out, you want to do this, yeah. blah, blah, blah. And but then, even then, that would, to me, would be like, Okay, is this something or all right? Let's do it. It's like she likes hanging out with me, but is this like is there more to that? Not How yet. do you know? Hmm. How do you know? Basically, if you just want to talk a girl, if you want to talk to a guy, talk to him. Yeah, it's it, honestly talking to guys is the easiest thing. I and think. if he has a girlfriend, leave him alone. Oh, that's true. It's entrapment. <laughs> it's entrapment. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, yeah, I, I think talking to guys is easy, the easiest thing. I think it's easier. For most a girl guys talk to a guy than yeah, a guy because most girl. guys would just be willing to like accept this like <laughs> conversation, you know. Yeah. <laughs> well, not like that, but like you know, they'll be more <laughs> willing to accept this this friendship or whatever, whatever this is gonna be. Mm-hmm. A conversation, than, yeah. Than trying to have a guy talk to a girl. Most girls would be like, no. Or I don't think if you were like message him, like let's say slide in his DMs, I don't think his response is gonna be, "The fuck is this?" It was like. No, ill, no. <laughs> no, it's gonna be just like ew, woman. if you know each other already, then it's gonna be like, Oh, she messaged me, nice, hello. Yeah. Like kind of immediately. But like, if it's some random girl, then it's like, Okay, is this account real? Yeah. Because yeah, it's, it's like it's it never sketch. happens. <laughs> <laughs> no, it, no, it happens, but it's like the counts are always fake. The counts are always fake. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, that's true. The counts always fake. I see she has zero followers, she's following no one. Oh hell yeah. She's got <laughs> she, she's got two thousand followers with one post and like she's following two people. Yeah, it's kind of weird, and you never n- know each other. Like, if yeah. you don't know him, I think that's the hard part. Like, trying to what was word I'm looking for? What, what was it? Oh yeah, making the first move on someone you don't know. Mm. If it's in person, yeah, definitely. But if it's like over DM, you can still try. It. Actually, just make the first move. Just Regard- <laughs> regardless, regardless, just fucking do it. <laughs> regardless. Just just fucking do it. <laughs> Please. <laughs> <laughs> that's funny. Okay, next question. Do guys like to cuddle just as much as girls do? Yes. I, yep. I, yes. Yes. Definitely. Yes. Yeah. yes. That's why yes. I have minus a the body head, pillow. Minus the face. We like it so much. I'll take the face full of hair. Oh, that tickles so much. I got allergies, bro. <laughs> <laughs> it's like the allergies, bro. I'll, I'll take it. Whatever. My hair is long. Hell, you get a face full of hair for once. <laughs> <laughs> you want to be the little spoon? <laughs> I wouldn't mind. I want. Okay, I like to be cuddled. I want to yeah. be I, held. I just like to be a whole <laughs> held. Held. <laughs> Uh, vice versa, uh, us in this room, yes, yes. Yeah. Yeah, 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 definitely. Why am I gonna say no? Exactly. It was like gotta, we gotta, we be, gotta like, be honest. No, go away. You kind of smell. <laughs> <laughs> I, I think that'd probably be like the only way. <laughs> no, even then, <laughs> I'm just the like you're going nowhere. <laughs> 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 I 
What if she just rips one? <laughs> I've had that happen. <laughs> oh, we were talking about this. We were talking this. about this. What? In the last episode, yeah. It was like uh, Valentine's Day. It was the next morning. She spent the night. We didn't do anything. Uh-huh. But again, which is like, why are you so fucking friendly? Why? <laughs> she just ripped one. <laughs> like god damn all That's right funny. if you want to listen to that listen to the other episode if it's out let's see would you ever date a woman taller than you yes of course yeah i would i mean i am I'm small again i am small but i taller woman why not i will climb you like a tree i don't give a fuck <laughs> <laughs> what if she's so tall that you have to go up on her <laughs> Again, I don't care. Yeah. Oh yeah, I don't see anything bad with it. I don't see it either. For us in this no room, problem. you don't care. Some dudes might feel weird and yeah, emasculated. And emasculated, but, but then again, those are very insecure dudes. Yeah. I don't know if I mentioned this earlier in the podcast, but like, if you're dating a dude that's five eleven and he complains and actually genuinely feels like he's short because he's not six foot. Get rid of him. He's very insecure. One of the most insecure dudes you ever meet in your life, by the way. Go attack. <laughs> <laughs> you five eleven? I'm five eleven. Are you? You're five eleven. Yeah. You're not five eleven. Too bad your brother's six total. Six As, two. You know what? I I get mad because I'm the oldest and I'm the shortest. It doesn't make any sense. Welcome man. to my world. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. My sister. My sister's shorter, but still, out of the guys, yeah. Dude, like my brother, the youngest one is six four. I think the real question is, would a tall girl date a shorter guy? Ooh, or that's a, girl a good, that's a good guy. question. I don't know. Because I feel like the guy is going to say yes. Majority it's, of them, at least. It's pretty rare to see, but I s- do see it sometimes. Like, we have a homie that's into taller girls. Yeah. yeah oh, yeah. Because he's, like, he's small like Robert. He's, I think he's <laughs> an inch smaller. I think he's actually smaller than yeah, Robert. Yeah, he's an inch smaller. But he's, like, only likes taller women. Like, that's yep. his preference. He just, I don't know, he's just, he like, the same thing. He just wants to climb a woman. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that's funny. That is funny. But yes, out of us in this room, if you were taller, make the first move. <laughs> <laughs> yes, we appreciate it. <laughs> Very much. Why are you saying that? Uh, okay, I feel like up. this one's <laughs> I feel like this one's easy. Do you find piercings attractive? Yes. Well, where? Oh, okay. Everywhere. There you go. That that that's what I was Okay. Yes. I don't feel either way about them. Yes. Like like it is kind of like it can be hot. Like you don't have to have them, but if you do. Cool. Okay. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I like it. Yeah. I like woman. I like. I like woman. <laughs> <laughs> like, I can't think of a spot that makes me go ew, like maybe on the eyeball because that's kind of new. You could do that. You could maybe. Do that? Like that's why oh. I'm saying something like freaky. I don't like know. just like is that a thing? Maybe. Oh. I don't. Know. Maybe Eyebrow, if it's like extreme. Nose, septum, like lip ring. Uh, uh, unless they're the plugs. Part of those, like, doesn't matter to things. me. Like there's oh. people who have like. Like the cheek, the angel like bites, studs and stuff. Oh, those are angel nice. bites, yeah. Or they, they have they have the David Draymon, the gauges. The, no, David Draymon, which is like the things coming from his lips. Oh yeah, yeah, oh. yeah. I know uh, what you, about. Let's look up the lead singer for Disturbed if you don't know who we're talking about. Those type oh, of piercings, even though that, that might be kind of hot. Maybe I don't know. I don't know. I just don't like when they have that huge like gauges. Gauges. I don't. I don't like that. Well, I'm in the metal scene, so you I'm used to that. A peepee in there. <laughs> oh. I got wouldn't mind that. Like that. You ever get freaky <laughs> with that thing? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. All right, let's go. Yes. So piercings are a yes. yes. What about tattoos? Oh yeah. Oh of yeah. Of course. Yeah, well, I have tattoos. It'd be weird if I didn't like. I, have, I just got my tattoos. first tattoo. Did you? Nice. Oh, what? yeah. The, what? Yeah, now you're going to laugh me? when you see it. Oh, I am going to laugh. I want to see it. have to preface this. I want people to find out which one of us has a tattoo on our ass. Don't say who it is. <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't know who it is. <laughs> Just comment who you think it is. Wait, wait, wait. Hold up. Were you have a tattoo? Yeah. Of what? Oh, shit. You're looking kind of attractive right now. <laughs> <laughs> That's, it's just Brownie like a little thing too? like that big. Of what? It's a skull. <laughs> <laughs> who gave me that? Lolly. Oh, um, oh, okay, yeah, she does that. I yeah. she's learning tattoos. Yeah, yeah, that's cool. Oh, also a plus if she does tattoos. That is kind of pretty no. cool. Because cool. I'm an artist. On my, my bicep. <laughs> On the bicep, bro. You want to see it laugh? <laughs> <laughs> Start flexing. I know, I'm actually dance. trying to. I'm trying to finish up mine. I'm waiting for one piece to finish. It's never gonna finish. Sorry, but off topic. <laughs> but yeah, I'm waiting for it to finish. I can finish my leg. Continue. Oh, for Same. those that don't watch anime, that that's anime, by the way. One mm-hmm. piece. One piece. Try it out. Okay. <laughs> oh, <fuck laughs> Next that. one's more serious. Uh, what about stretch marks or cellulite? No, it's that doesn't bother me. With that. I, I, I don't me. care. 
But yeah. the weird thing is, if you had tattoos of stretch marks, then huh? that's like tattoos of a stretch mark. That would be weird to me. Well, yeah. Oh, I thought well, you meant well, like some people. Yeah. Obviously, but it's not, a no. it's not, not a no. Not covering it up, but like getting of it, stretch that's marks. Kind of questionable, tattoos. but not going to stop me. No, yeah, yeah I know. Mm. Definitely that's not. That's ta- what I'm saying. Because you either got it from like being marks, big and getting small or getting like, small and getting big. Either way. Well, I mean, I, I had them when I lost a ton of weight at one point. Yeah. I have them now. <laughs> <laughs> so why would I, you know, why would I care if the girl has them? I got that tiger and... belly. <laughs> <laughs> Oh God! <laughs> that, that all makes sense now. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Yeah. Uh, the guys in this room, we don't care. No, nope. uh-huh. doesn't bother me. Bring it on. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. It's right Cusco. <laughs> but some dudes care about it, and if he shows that he does, and he just he, tastes he's, it, he's a little bitch, man. Get rid of him. Yeah, <laughs> he's a little bitch, that's man. That's all I have to say, because he probably has even more problems. Yeah. Uh, what is your opinion on female body hair? This one's interesting. Mm. Like full out armpit hair. It's like I'm braided, boy. It's weird because it's, it's not something we're used to as Americans. Girls just yeah. don't have armpit hair. Yeah. Like I, if it's it, starting it was to always trend a, a thing. Bit more. Yeah, it's starting to trend, but I'm saying like we weren't grown up with it, so it's still it is a little weird. Yeah. I wouldn't. It doesn't bother me too much. Let's say as long as it's under like, like controlled. You know, it's not like mine. It's not. It's not like like it's just like all bushed out. You know, because I I trim my armpit hair to be honest. Yeah. As you should. Yeah. yeah. Like, you know, I like to keep everything. I try to keep everything <laughs> nice and neat. <laughs> <laughs> I try. Man, yeah. It's a lot of work. No, yeah, I, it, it wouldn't bug me. Full bush. But then again, I'm... Full bush? Why not? Get a weed wiper. I mean... Mm. No. <laughs> I, 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 got some, I got some bean blood in me. I can mow a lawn. Yeah, right? <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I think that's all of us here, bro. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but that, yeah, it's just the uh, social norms of, like, let's say, hair anywhere else. It's kind of... We're not used to it. Not yeah. used to it, but I wouldn't say it would bother us too much. No, yeah. no, it wouldn't bother me too much. But it's like, just I think it's a hygiene question as well. Like, are you being hygienic? Then it's fine. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah, definitely. That's why I like Because armpit hair, honestly, it's like, okay, kind of weird. But again, I like woman. Let's well, I mean, give it a like, shot. She has like stubble. I'm like, oh, that's yeah, that doesn't matter. Stubble, yeah. that does nothing. Doesn't matter. Full out. Maybe. Let me get to know you a little more. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Cleavage versus bare neck versus bare legs. What? That, that, what that's do you like ooh. more? Cleavage? Huh? Bare neck or bare legs? I like legs. Nah, bro, that's a different that's a difficult question to be honest, man, cuz yeah, I like I, li- I like all three. Honestly, yeah. I like, I like all, all three. three. Um, <gasps> I'm indecisive between no, it's actually hard or legs. It, it's a, it's a I hard really one, bro. Like legs. I don't know. I was like if they got a nice pair of legs, it's like Damn, like that I won't even pay attention to like the cleavage. <laughs> it's like they got they got nice legs. It's even more weird. Like if you're looking them in the face, or like you're standing face to face, and you're just like there. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Just I, don't find, I find legs attractive. I don't I don't know. Know. It's hard because I like necks <laughs> as well. Yep. Yeah, no, I understand you because it's yeah. the same thing here. Yeah. Like it's it's. Why are you looking at me like that? The nape of your neck. <laughs> neck boy. It's like, <laughs> it's a really vampiric thing to say, but it's like I like I like a good neck. Yeah, I understand you on that because I'm, th- I'm kind of the same way too. But oh. I like bare legs. I love bare legs. I l- uh, yeah, I really like that too. I'm, I'm a man who likes women. <laughs> I know that. Titties, <laughs> come on. Cle- you got to get that cleavage out. Cleavage. <laughs> 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 oh, fuck. I'm, I'm honestly probably going to have to pick bare legs though. Damn. <sighs> when it comes down to I'm, it, I'm, my vote is bare legs. I think legs. At the, I got to say I legs guess too. I'm the uh, odd man out. <laughs> <laughs> I guess titties. Yeah. Okay, I knew it. I respect that. I respect <laughs> That's a respectful opinion. answer. It's <laughs> <laughs> a respectful answer. <laughs> Which leads into the last question. Oh. The hardest question Fuck. of them all. Boobs or booty? Oh. Boobs. Booty. I'm a booty man. Booty, bro. Oh, booty. Yeah, Brandon. Booty, bro. The Brandon. booty man. Yeah, Brandon's the booty. <laughs> booty <yeah>. bandit. <laughs> I, I, like, I like booty. I like, booty, I like, bro. Yeah. I guess again. Do I I'm like out. both? <laughs> yes. Oh, of course. Still respect but. your answer. <laughs> but it's all about the booty. The booty I wins. I like all boobs. Girl boobs, guy boobs. <laughs> <laughs> it's all about them. Booty. Man titties, girl titties. <laughs> <laughs> Big booty hoes. Oh, yeah, I think. I'm going for boobs. I'm sorry, guys. I have a small pee-pee. I can't do anything with a big butt. By the way, like <laughs> <laughs> okay, wait, what? Wait, you, just, you just made me like... <laughs> oh, <dude. laughs> 
do I gotta change my answer now? <laughs> Right. You're just like, damn. <laughs> damn, that's some real shit. <laughs> Good thing you're not wearing pants. <laughs> uh, I'm sticking to my answer, though. Yeah, that concludes that. All those questions. Mansers, man. I definitely want to do this again because I feel like there should be more questions. There are oh, yeah, definitely, definitely some that I haven't seen, but I'm not going to mention right now. Well, one of them was the, the whole nude situation. Oh, oh yeah. okay. Let's get creative. At the same time, remember, this is only four dudes within this garage. I hear a fucking cricket. Yeah, what yeah. I've like been hearing it like halfway. Th- I, I mean, we're maybe have more I, than halfway. I can hear it within my headphones. Uh, I don't know. We answered these to the best w- of our abilities. And remember, this is only our uh, views. This isn't the views of all men. This is basic. Us. <laughs> we're basic men. Basic. <laughs> basic podcast. Try to give good answers, not just basic answers. We do the best that we can. Yes. <laughs> That's our abilities. But if you want to ask us even more questions, uh, leave them on our YouTube if this is up. But Spotify version should be up before YouTube for at least like a week or two. Uh, I don't think you leave comments on Spotify, so do it on Apple or Google Podcasts. Oh, that's cool. Or anywhere you find podcasts. This should be on any other on uh, all the engine platforms. you find podcasts. Yeah. Wait, uh, never mind. We'll, talk, we'll discuss it later. Yeah. Or shoot us a DM, DM the first move into our, <laughs> on our Instagram. Okay, then, at that, basic that's podcast. what I was going to say. Yeah. Like, yeah, if we have a, we'll, we'll eventually we'll talk put about up our Instagram and stuff. Yeah, we'll leave the links and everything if you want to cool. ask us even yeah. more questions so we can Definitely. do a, a part two of Mansers. That'd be fun. A show. That'd be fun that's to good. do. And I want to ask the idea of doing a reverse girls answering the guys' questions. Oh, Ooh, that'd be cool. I'd, oh, that'd like, be awesome. Like, get our homies, get awesome. like, of definite, define 10 questions, 20, 12. Yeah. Oh, that that we good. want answered. That'd be, that'd be and see what, like, the majority is to those questions. Yep. Yeah, that sounds good. good show. Other than that, really hope good. you enjoyed this episode. I Remember, did. this is kind of a comedy <laughs> podcast. <laughs> <laughs> Try to make it funny, but... Some of these were we did our best. required serious answers. And remember, yeah. we're a bunch of just a bunch of fucking idiots. So yeah, that's true. Yes, it's all about boobs, guys. Thank you. And at this point <laughs> in time, actually, all our viewers are <laughs> listeners are female. So oh, I respect women. And the <laughs> <laughs> all, right. all right, we're gonna leave it out right there. All right. All right.